Today we're taking a look at the KBO Breeze, a $1,500 commuter e-bike. So what do you get for $1,500 and is it fun to ride? Well, I'll tell you right now, this thing is a lot of fun to ride. With its electronic throttle, I feel like I'm riding a quiet motorcycle. So going back, what do you get for $1,500? Well, you actually get quite a lot. You're gonna get a 48 volt, 16 amp power battery with Samsung LG cells. This is actually larger than average e-bike batteries. This battery is rated for 900 full charge cycles and it only takes five hours to fully charge the battery. There is a 500 watt motor with a peak of 750 watts. The range per fully charged battery is about 35 miles when throttling and 55 miles with the pedal assist. You're gonna have mechanical disc brakes, front suspension, headlights and taillights, a large rear rack for storing things. You got a twist throttle, which is my favorite part of this thing. We've got large 27 and a half inch Panasonic tires, full fenders and a kickstand. Putting this bike together was actually a breeze pun intended. It mostly came put together in the box. I had to just install the front wheel, front fender, headlights, seat, and pedals. The back wheel, motor, gears, and wiring were already done for me. All right, let's see how this thing rides. We're going to go ahead and turn it on, push the button right here. Here are the controls. So we've got battery level, we've got speed, we've got our power assist, we've got how much distance we have gone, and then up here, which you can't see, it is going to be our throttle. That is going to throttle up right there. We have got our throttle right here. So as I turn it, it's going to start moving. We can maybe see that power kicking up a little bit. But let's go ahead and ride it and see how good this thing is. All right, we're going to take this thing uphill now. But let's obviously give it a little bit more power with the throttle here. No pedaling whatsoever. see the full throttle right there this thing is awesome i absolutely love this throttle being able to rev it like a motorcycle it is just a ton of fun using this thing so i like how the bike rides i like the placement of the throttle and i like the power of the motor i also like that it has a functioning tail light and headlight but there is actually one thing that i would change I noticed that when I put the pedal assist all the way down to zero, meaning that it's not automatically gonna kick in that motor when I start pedaling, the throttle stops working. To me, I didn't like that. I would like to maybe turn that pedal assist off, turn it all the way down to zero, but still have the ability to do the throttle control. I don't wanna kill it all together. I contacted KBO and they said that this is kind of a standard for e-bikes. If you turn off the pedal assist, the throttle turns off itself. Personally, I don't like that but that's just what it is with these bikes. Overall, this is a great commuter bike and was a lot of fun to ride. If you are looking for something nice and affordable that just works well, this is what I'd recommend picking up. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If this video was helpful, give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. As always, don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. We'll see you in the next video.